Hello everybody, welcome back to our 3 info channel. In today's video I'll show you how to assemble your Acer Nitro XZ273U monitor. So first we're not gonna touch the monitor first. We're gonna go ahead and put the stands together. So let's grab this part right here. Now let's grab the second one. And the most important thing is you don't need this screwdriver for it because it comes with a little screwdriver itself as you guys can see you guys can switch it up and you guys can spin it around it's very comfortable so now make sure you push it all the way up and now just place your second part on it now all you have to do is just spin it around here until you feel it goes in so now I felt that it was going in now I'm just gonna keep on spinning and I'm done I can hide it and our stand is now ready so the second part we're finally moving on to the monitor the long-awaited time here let me get rid of those cables first here we have our stand. Now we need to place it exactly on the stand. So I'll put it like that. It will be way easier. Trust me, you need to put the monitor on those two. So let's just grab the monitor right here. And now all that's left to do is place it on those two edges. So it's going to be very easy, trust me. I'll put it closer, a bit closer. Now you need to put the monitor in a specified angle. So it won't be that easy and it won't be that hard. As you guys can see, I have to put it in a weird angle first. And that weird angle worked. As you guys can see, we've got our monitor. Now we can just turn it around. And that's how it looks like. So I'm sorry if I'm covering the camera. Here we have our monitor ready. As you guys can see, it might be a bit, might not be straight. But let's skip that for now. Let's connect every single cable here. There's a lot of them. So the first one, we will plug this into our monitor. So this is basically a power adapter. Now we're gonna grab a second port for it. And here we need to plug this part like that. We need to plug it inside of our power adapter. Now it's ready and we can plug it into our power. So let me quickly do that. And after we plug it into the power, we will see that the light here turned green. So what can we do next? we can plug it into our monitor. So let me turn it around for now. And here we will have the power port. So basically the power port is kind of hidden. It's right here. So let's just put it here. Now our monitor should be working. And now we're gonna grab a display port cable that we have gotten with the monitor we're gonna enter it in the port so the port is right on the right side now it might take a while i don't want to destroy anything and it's kind of hard to do that with one hand so give me a second so we're ready it just needed a little bit of a kick and now we need to plug it into our computer. So basically after plugging it, you should have your monitor ready. So now all that's left to do is turn it on and we should be okay. So here we will have the button. It's right here at the bottom. We need to click it. And as you guys can see, the HR Nitro shows up. So now we will see if it turns on. And here we have our beast. 
So as you guys can see, the monitor is working perfectly fine and we successfully managed to assemble it. So that'd be it for the video. I hope it was helpful. If it was, then leave a like, subscription and a comment and I'll see you in the next one.